Hello people out in YouTube land. Today I wanted to show you a bit of the browser with push because it seems that some people did not get all the functionality you have with that. So if you press the browse button and here I have selected the policy already, you see now all the columns which are available to filter your presets or also your devices. What you should note is that you, if you use the cursor keys, you can go through the through the different tabs in the browser. So you can switch to samples, to music, and presets, and to the left to the devices. And what I did now, the navigation is slowed down, so the selection is now much easier to do. And what you should note that you cannot only use the knob to change a preset, you can also use the button below the knob so you can go to the next preset and you can go to the previous preset and by doing that it's very easy to check out your sounds. Another thing to mention is that now also the tap tempo button can be used to change the last selected column. For example now I last touched the presets so I can also change the presets by using that knob and the advantage of using that knob is that that one has a raster. It's much easier to get a feeling when the next preset is selected. So the same for if I touch the category, then I can change the category by using that knob as well. So much for the browser. Till next time, bye.